The Zimbabwe Anti-Corruption Commission ZACC, has arrested four officials from the Harare City Council for allegedly dishing a 9.2 million US dollar street lights tender to Moses Mpofu without following proper procedures. Harare City Council officials dish out 9 million US dollar street lights tender to Moses Mpofu. The officials are never Murawa, 62. Manager of the supply chain in the procurement management unit, Jabulani Mokamatsi, 44, Principal Buyer, Denfer Juangu, 69, Principal Accountant, and Tawanda Mutant Habundo, 29, Engineering Technician, they allegedly awarded the tender to Juluka Endo Joint Venture, a company owned by businessman Moses Mpofu. Mpofu is currently in remand prison with Mike Mpofu on separate fraud charges involving 87 million US dollars which was meant for the presidential GOAT scheme. He got the streetlights tendered despite his company failing to meet the necessary requirements. According to ZACC, the charges stem from the time the officials served on the Tender Evaluation Committee for the Streetlight Refurbishment Project, identified as Tender Number COH slash DAO slash S.5 slash 2024. The project was part of the city's preparations for the upcoming SADC Summit that I in January, the city of Harare initiated a project to rehabilitate streetlights along various roads. The Procurement Regulatory Authority of Zimbabwe, Karezi, granted some exemptions to ensure the projects were completed in time for the summit. An invitation to tender was published in the Government Gazette on March 15 and listed on the PRAZ portal on March 19. Eleven companies responded to the tender invitation, including Juluka Endo Joint Venture. On March 28, Murawa appointed the Tender Opening Committee. By April 19, the Evaluation Committee, including Mukamatsi, Juangu, and Mutant Habundo, awarded most of the tender to Cyvern Investments, Exodus & Company, Ship Tracks, and Onal Engineering. Juluka Endo Joint Venture was initially disqualified for not meeting the tender requirements.